Hey guys! So in today's video, I'm actually going to show you my makeup collection. Now I will say, A, I'm not trying to brag, I just know that these videos are really popular and I love watching them. B, I have pretty much collected makeup. I mean, other people collect, you know, my mom collects stamps, like people collect coins. My friends collect those little pop vinyl figures, which now I collect too, thanks Patrick and Jane. But for the longest time, I've just collected makeup. So yeah. Also, I'm sorry if the footage is going to be weird during this. This is my first video that I'm filming on my Canon Rebel T5i, so just starting to get used to that. So if anything turns out shaky or the lighting is off, I apologize. And yeah, oh, I will say that things here are purchased by me, gifts, things that my friends have gotten and didn't like. I didn't necessarily buy everything in here. And also, this technically isn't all my makeup, I know that sounds ridiculous, but I have some still at my dad's house, we haven't cleaned his house out yet, so I have some stuff still there, I have some at my mom's, this is just what I have where I live now, and yeah, let's get into it! So the makeup storage that I have is the Ikea Alex, and it's the 9 drawer, so we'll start with on top of it. I will say that right next to this is actually my vanity where I do my makeup, but it is a huge mess right now, so I'm not going to show you that. So I have a candle burning right here. It is just the Target Cozy Nights candle. All right, so behind that, I just have a makeup bag. That is actually my everyday product. And if not my everyday product, then what I would take with me if I were to spend the night out, I will show you guys what's actually in that last. I have my brushes here, and then I have my Fix Plus. That little brown one is what I use to blend in my under eye concealer, and I have two Kabukis. Normally my mirror goes right here, but that's where my camera was actually just sitting. Alright, so in the first drawer right here, I have pencil eyeliners all right here. I have pretty much every color known to mankind when it comes to eyeliner. This middle drawer right here, I have gel liners all right in here, and then I have liquid liners over here. I have mascaras next. In the back, I have miscellaneous eyebrow related products. It won't come out all the way, but these are all brow pencils, highlights, tweezers. Behind that, I have fake lashes and lash glue, and I have a lash card back there too. Over here, I have my eyelash curler. And I have my eyeliner sharpeners. So that's the top drawer. All right, so the second drawer. So in the back here, I have all my pigment shadows. And I have just some mineral shadows in the back too. You know, the ones that you can use wet or dry. Up here, I have my cream shadows. And then I have eye primers and bases. Here, I have my single shadows. And I have some duos in the back as well. I was going to say, it ranges everything NYX, MAC, Wet n Wild in there. I've got literally everything. I have more Avon than I can count because my mother used to sell Avon, so I have a lot of that. Alright, and here I have my trios and quads. I have a few that are more than quads too, but trios are all in here. And then over here... Mostly quads, I have, you know, a six shadow palette, a nine shadow palette, just, you know, smaller ones. I have right here my Chanel quad, my favorite thing that I've ever owned. My MAC Hello Kitty, which is, again, one of my most prized products that I've ever owned. I love the Rocky Horror palette. I love down here, I have the Maybelline quads when they came out with the Smoky quads. Oh my god, they're amazing. Still to this day, they're so old, they're so good. I got those back in high school. Okay, so this is where things start to get a little ridiculous. I clearly need more storage. So this is the first lip drawer. So we'll start with, if you can see it back there. So those are tinted lip balm stick kind of things. It's like the Revlon lip butters, those kinds of ones. Back here, I just have my lipsticks. They range from, you know, NYX, a lot of NYX actually, a lot of Maybelline some Avon, a lot of Rimmel, my Kate Spade one that I actually got on clearance at Nordstrom Rack. I love Nordstrom Rack. Here I have my lip liners. Oh, I also have my Bite 
uh, lip BB cream right there, or BB color, whatever they consider it. This part right here is all my pencils. So like the NYX Chunky Dunks, the NYX Simply Vamp, my Bite Beauty lip pencil, my Lorac matte pencil. I have all my Tarte Lip Surgeons pencils there. This middle section is definitely my favorite. So these right here, it is two rows here. These are my MAC lipsticks and my YSL lipsticks. Those are the ones that I reach for the most just because I know that they have great staying power. As much as I love my other lipsticks, these are the ones I just always go back to. So I have lip glosses and balms here. Now you can't really tell there's another little clear section in the back. That's for all my squeezy tube lip glosses. Down the side here, I have lip balms. Back in here, I have like tinted lip conditioners, that kind of thing. I have a lip scrub from uh, Lush. Here, I've got like my baby lips, my Benna Balm, my Lolly Balm, my NYX lip butter, what are they? The butter lip balms. And then here are my glosses. So these are mostly NYX. I have a lot of MAC buried underneath there, actually. I have some Urban Decay, some Dior. These were mostly my Stila ones, actually. I got one of those Christmas sets that had all of them in it. So, oh yeah, I got a lot in that. If you can tell, there's about three layers of lip glosses in each of these bins. I really need to get more storage. Next drawer down. So this is pretty much everything for my face. So I have foundations going all the way down this side. I've got some BB creams in there too. In the back, I have my face primers over here. I have more foundation laying down on the side that can't stand up. I have my bronzer and blush palettes. Underneath those, over oh, there's finishing powders, concealers. I believe that's all that's in there. My makeup wipes are all right here. I have a blush palette right here. And then under that is just all my blushes and bronzers. Yes, that is quite a pile of them, I'm well aware. But yeah, I've been developing this, like I said, for years. And this palette right here is absolutely amazing, by the way. Like, if you are still able to find it, I would highly suggest buying it. It's amazing. So the next drawer down, if you can't tell, it's full, literally. My finger goes right here, the top's right here, like. But these are all my palettes. And it goes pretty far back in there. So it's mostly eyeshadow palettes. I do have my Too Faced Brow palette in there too. But I have all the naked ones right here. Under my Stila, I have all the Lorac ones there. And then everything else is just a toss-up. I have a lot of Too Faced, a lot of Tarte, I have some YSL, I have some Anastasia. It, it's a fun drawer. I enjoy playing in this drawer a lot. So then I have hair products in here, and I've just got, you know, my flat iron, which believe it or not, this Remington one actually works a whole lot better than my Chi ever worked. I have clip-in bangs, some hair brushes, I have an in-styler in there. Some dry shampoo, some hairspray, a shine brush, some spray serum, a glove for when I curl my hair, a headband back there. I have some coconut oil for when I do hair masks. My curling wand is in here some up. Oh, my curling wand right there. But yeah, so that's just my basic hair care drawer. And then I have my nail stuff. So I have a UV lamp, I have acetone, cotton rounds, Q-tips. Those are some nail files right next to the Q-tips. Some, you know, at-home press-on nails behind it. My nail clippers are somewhere in this drawer and I just have no clue where they are. And yeah, that's just the bottom drawer. I don't have nail polish in there because if we stand up, my nail polish is actually right here next to my makeup storage. Yeah, now on to the fun part, my everyday makeup bag. All right, so I figured for my everyday makeup bag, it would be easier to just show me showing them because I can't hold a camera and show you everything at the same time because I suck at multitasking. All right. 
so I have my foundation, which you guys have seen in like all my videos. It's my YSL, the Fusion Ink Foundation. Anastasia Brow Wiz. Now the point of this bag is A, to have all my everyday products grouped together, and B, if you know, I end up at the last minute being like, oh, I'm gonna spend, you know, the night at my best friend's house, or oh, I'm gonna go to my mom's, cause you know, I'm not having a good day and I just want my mom. Something like that, you know, I just have all my stuff good to go. My face primer, which is the Too Faced Primed and Poreless, which is pretty much empty at this point. Face powder. Concealer. Under eye powder. Bronzer. Eyeshadow. More eyeshadow. Blush. Highlight for under my brows. Liquid liner. Pencil liner. Brow gel. Shadow primer. Mascara. My eyebrow pomade, which is what I use if it's on a regular basis, but if I'm spending the night, I'm not gonna have my brush, which is why I have the Brow Wiz with me. Powder blush, in case you know, I do happen to have any brushes on me. Then I have a neutral lipstick, just like I said, in case I end up spending the night somewhere. I have one of my favorite lip glosses, because it goes with any lipstick. And I have a lip balm pencil. And yeah, I probably still have some lipstick in my purse. I'm not even going to lie about that. Sorry, if I'm looking away, I'm putting everything back into the bag now. Yeah, I probably have more lipstick in my purse. I can probably, honestly, if I'm more just looking around the room, because my room is a complete pigsty right now, and it's probably just strewn about everywhere. I also have my Ipsy bag that I haven't actually taken everything out of yet, so it'll go in there too. But yeah, just all that fun stuff. So I hope that you guys like this. Again, this is just my makeup collection. Not trying to brag. I just absolutely love watching these videos. I love seeing how other people organize theirs. It's all a hell of a lot better than organize mine, I can tell you that. My life's a mess. My organization's a mess. But yeah, if you like this video, please subscribe. Please give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment. And I will see you guys on Sunday. Keep forgetting what day of the week it is. I'm terrible at this keeping track of days of the week thing. Bye guys. She's just a baby.